بسم الله And the storyline begins. The hadith of Fatima bint Qais radiallahu anha. She says that the messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he sat on his member smiling. Then the messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Do you know why I have gathered you here today? And the companions of the messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, that Allah and His Messenger know best. Then the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, that I haven't gathered you here today to give you a warning, but I have gathered you here today because a man, Tamim Uddari, has come and embraced Islam and he has told me something with that which I have told you regarding the Antichrist. He told me, they are sailed in a ship with 30 men from two tribes. He says that the waves have been tossing them around and about for a month. He says that at the time of sunset, they landed on the island where they met a beast who was so hairy that they could not tell from his front to its back. We said, woe to you. What are you? And it said, that I am Al-Jassasa. And then he said, go to this monastery, go to that monastery. For there is a man who is very eager to know about you. He says, we quickly went to the monastery. And there we seen a huge man with his hands tied up to his neck, iron shackles between his ankles, between his legs up to his ankles. We said, woe to you, who are you? And he said, never mind who I am. Soon you will come to know who I am. Tell me who are you? They said that we are people from Arabia. We sailed in a ship where the waves have been tossing us around and about for a month. When we landed on your island, we met a beast who was so hairy that we could not tell from his front to his back. We said, woe to you. What are you? And he said, that I am al Jassasa. Then he said, that go to the monastery for there's a man who is very eager to know about you. He says, we quickly went to you. We quickly went to the monastery and there we found you. Then the man in the iron chain said, tell me about the date palms of Baysan. We said, what do you want to know about it? He said, that does he have fruit on it? Does he bear fruit? We said, yes. He goes, a time will come. They will not bear fruit. Tell me about the lake of Tabaria. We said, what do you want to know about it? He said that does he have water in it? We said, yes, he has plenty of water in it. He goes, a time will come that it will dry out. Tell me, tell me about the spring of Zuhara, we said, what do you want to know about it? He said, does he have water in it and do the people use it to irrigate the land? We said, yes, he has plenty of water in it and the people use it to irrigate the lands. And then the man in the iron chain said, tell me about this unlettered prophet. And we said, that he has left Mecca and he has migrated to Medina. And then he said, do the Arabs fight against him? Do the Arabs fight against him? 
We said yes. He goes, how does he deal with them? Then they said, that the messenger has overcome them and those who surround him have followed him. And then the man in the iron chains said, has this really happened? Has this really happened? It is better for them that if they follow him. Now I will tell you who I am. I am the imposter. I am the antichrist. And soon I will emerge. Soon I will be emerged. I will be released from this place and I will travel the world and I will enter city to city except Makkah and Medina. Why? Because there will be angels surrounding this place. Every entrance, there'll be angels with their swords out that will prevent him, prevent me from entering. And then the messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Striking his pulpit. He said, this is Medina. This is Medina. This is Medina. And the messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, that did I not tell you something like this? The companions of the messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Oh messenger of Allah, yes you did. Then the messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, that I like the account given to me by Tamim Dari. Why? Because it agrees with that which I have told you regarding the Antichrist, regarding Makkah and Medina. Then the Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said that he's in the Yemen Sea or he is in the Syrian Sea. And then he said, no, 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 he's in the East, he's in the East, he's in the East. The Messenger Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, when he said this, Wallahi, by Allah, my brothers, this, this shouldn't be taken lightly. Why? Because the Antichrist is coming, whether you like it or you don't like it.